I came and I was supposed to be here for 10 days and I was only here for five because I said, I'm leaving and I'm coming back for good. <laughs> and I did. I volunteer because it's really a lifestyle choice more than anything else. I think coming here, really what I've always been looking for is this type of life. We have only one life together, so we're really working and living and free time and fun time. It's not really a work. Also, before I really worked and then I went home and had my free time here. And here you have to figure out how you can fit it together in one whole day. Because you get up in the morning, wake up the guys, live together, eat together, and then work and the, the whole day long, lunch, dinner, everything. After graduating college, I didn't know what I wanted to do with my degree, and I wasn't a huge fan of what I was supposed to be doing. So I started looking for ways to help people. Like at zero, I mean, when I got here, I was like, wow, what can I even offer? Like, I don't have any idea what I'm talking about. Um, but the more I released the need to know what to do, I think the more natural I felt just being social with people and being social is something that I love and connecting with people especially. So, and of course those opportunities are in abundance here. Yeah, helping other people, helping each other out, living in a community, yeah, that's a very unique experience. Yeah, the big thing was ever to be not always think about yourself, then really think for the whole house, for the whole community, what is the best, what is, what is yeah, what's nice to do together and also to have fun together. And also in the hardest part, how you can support each other, that you be happy and have fun. Yeah, um, the biggest change in the last year, um, it's, it's really about how I relate to myself and how I relate to others. Oh yeah, I think I'm, I'm actually curious like how my family when I go back, <laughs> what, what they will say, like how I change. Um, instead of just how are they meeting my needs, it's how am I meeting my needs. You know, how, are, how am I affecting the world around me in a positive way. I'm definitely a different person. Tell me, how? Can't describe it. Yeah, I think it, it deepens my understanding of my humanness and how I want to be as a human. Um, because ultimately I want to learn how to love people the most that I possibly can and the best that I possibly can. And that's so different for every person that you meet. So, yeah. Like in any field, you're always going to work with other people together. So even if you're a scientist and are doing whatever research or, yeah, then you need to work with other people. And so you need social skills to, to be able to work with them. And that's something that you can very well acquire here. All the people around here just, they're, they're your family. You'll learn to love them right away, and they all love you immediately. <laughs> we were all sitting around the kitchen, and we were laughing, and it was just the coworkers and the friends, and we were all just sitting and enjoying each other's presence, and I realized that that was probably the happiest I've ever been. I love living with people with a shared mindset, and it's so nourishing. It's really just a place of growth for everyone. That's just it. <laughs>